Quix is a scale-up that specializes in photonic quantum computing. We do processors as well as full quantum computers and also offer online access to our machines. The unique part of the USP about Quix is really that we have a unique material platform. We're here in Twente because we are based on the knowledge of the university and there are about two decades of experience in producing very lossless photonic chips and you need lossless photonic chips to make the best quantum computers, the best photonic quantum computers especially. This is the first European photonic quantum computer that was ever built based on integrated photonics. The core element is our processor that is produced here in Twente. And this machine will be cloud accessible so that also universities and paying customers can use it as a sandbox to try some algorithms and try to solve some real world problems on it. This technology potentially could solve huge societal problems and issues which are not solvable today. And therefore this technology can actually change the world. I have two favorite examples. One is quantum chemistry because in principle you can map the calculation power of a quantum computer very well to quantum-like problems, like proteins, how they interact, how they fold, and this is something that currently a supercomputer is not able to solve. And quantum computers can solve those quantum-like problems and maybe have the possibility to really speed up drug development or developing new vaccines. Another example is way more trivial. This is, for example, energy distribution in a large energy grid. You know, um, when the sun is shining, we have a lot of solar power, we have wind power, and if one of the cables just breaks down by accident, you need to redirect all this energy very quickly. And therefore, also quantum computers can help to do this more or less in real time. I think Quick Quantum is a, is a typical company where OCNL should invest in because it's a completely new technology and a completely new market. The uncertainty is quite high, so access to capital is also a bit more difficult, but they achieved already actual results. They were already making significant revenues out of it by selling the first quantum computer. Therefore, this is a typical company where OSTNL can be a building block to accelerate this technology. The money, the funding that we got from the province of Overijssel enabled us to make more wafer runs and also to hire more experts. So really uh, to further develop the basic building blocks that now enable us to build the universal quantum computer one day. So we invested that money in basic research, fundamental research and uh, product development. And of course that, that goes together hand in hand with attracting talents and uh, bringing them here in the province of Oweisel, of course. People coming to us because they think that this so-called second quantum revolution really has value and can, can bring something meaningful. And so we're just a, a bunch of people, physicists, engineers who try to make the world just a tiny little bit better by better computations and better quantum computers.